One of my favorite features about drafts is the ability to prepare custom actions. These are little mini programs you create on your phone that do things just for you. They can range in complexity from a simple text message to a multi-step in-depth automation. Let's make an easy one together. First, I'm gonna tap on the actions button in the upper right corner. I could also just swipe over from right to left. Once here, you can see a list of all the actions installed and drafts comes with a bunch of pre-canned actions that you can use, but I wanna add a new one. So to do that, I tap the plus button in the lower right corner. Once I do that, I just tap on the add new action button and that opens up the edit action screen. This is where you create a new action. So first thing I'm gonna do is give it a name. And this is my emergency message. I live in Southern California where sometimes we have earthquakes and the cellular network never stays up long. So one of my common drafts is this message I've created. It sends a message to my wife and kids telling them I'm okay and where I'm at. And I send it out immediately after an earthquake. So they get the message, they know where I'm at, they know I'm okay, and hopefully write me back. I find it the easiest way to quickly get information to each other in an emergency. So I'm creating a custom action just for that. I'm going to tap on the icon next to emergency messages, and then I can select a custom icon, which is these multiple people, and I've made the color red. Next, I'm gonna add some steps. And you can see there's a lot of steps available. You can chain these together. But we're gonna do a simple one here. It's just gonna be a message. So I'll tap on message. And then I can start creating the message. First, I'll fill out the recipients. And normally you could do this with the plus button, but I'm just gonna type in names here. You can separate them by commas, and I'm adding names for each one of my family members. Normally you'd see the phone number or the email address, but for the screencast, I'm just gonna use the names. And then you can go below and fill out the body of the text message. And I'm going to type in the exact message I'd want to send in the case of an earthquake, saying I'm okay, and I'm at a certain location, how are you? Now, you see this double bracket or draft. That is going to grab the text from my draft, and that's going to tell them where I'm at. So when there's an emergency, I can just type in home or work or something like that, and then activate the draft, and it'll drop that right into the text message. Once I've got all the text in, I'm ready to save and exit. And then scrolling down, you can see there's my emergency message action that I just created. Once I've created the action, I can tap and hold on it and drag it up the list to make it more convenient. I can also edit it if I want later or duplicate it. All I have to do is slide from left to right and you get these options to edit, duplicate, or delete the action so you can make further changes. So let's see this in action. I'm going to create a new draft where I'm just going to type in the name of my location. Then I'm gonna to go to the action menu and press the emergency message button and I'm good. It's created my emergency message for me. It's filled in my location. All I have to do is hit the send button and I get it out to all of my family members really quick. This is a simple action that anybody can create and just the beginning of the power of drafts.